were torn apart just like y'all was Watching towers full of souls fall to sawdust Every time we called your office you ignored us Now you're holding hearings on us all inside of Congress Microscopes on us, asking which are hardest My answer was in line with all of the founding fathers I think Patrick said it best, give me liberty or death I shall never accept anything less You claim innocence, you play victimless But you gave the kiss of death in the name of self-defense Slavery and theft of other nations to the end Of pacifying your citizenry with excess We believe in freedom just as security But they're only pure when they're applied universally So certainly if I rage against the machine My aim was only to clean the germs out of the circuitry Urgently putting fear inside your heart Make you burn Qurans and tell me not to build a mosque Me, my wife and babies, we ain't never made your heart We just wanna touch our head to the floor and talk to God Ask him to remove every Every blemish from a heart The greatest threat of harm doesn't come from any bomb The moment you refuse the human rights for just a few What happens when that few includes you? Civil war Permanent Patriot here Uh, for those of you who thought I was going Where you thought I was With this video And the kitties You thought right uh, I forgot about it, but here it is here. See, that's what that's what ISIS does to people in cages. Okay. Uh, they're Islamic. They're they they hate Jews. It's, uh, what do you think they're gonna do with them? Do you think yeah they chop their hands off? Uh, who knows what they did to some of the other ones. Let's hit some of the fucking real news here. Ominous warning of coming chaos from former Navy SEAL. When the chaos begins, wherever you are, that's where you'll be stuck. You're damn right. And I plan on being stuck here. There's gonna be fucking no way to get out of the capital city when chaos strikes. Especially with one or two roads getting out. And uh, all sorts of strangeness all over the world. It's coming down, folks. So uh, you better be prepared. At least have two weeks of food, water. Which I have nothing near. Weather wars, FEMA camps, and takeover of America was the X-Files a dire warning to America of what's to come or more. Predictive programming, okay? And I keep telling you folks, they use it constantly. They, through television shows and especially through the movies. What they're going to do, and it tells you all about um, addictive programming. <sighs> Weather wars. They've been doing this since the 50s, folks. And they really started it in uh, Vietnam with the Ho Chi Minh Trail. There's another element, in case you haven't known, that uh, this dude basically came out with. 115, element 115 it's called. And uh, that dude Bob Lazar, um, supposedly from Area 51 who worked there, if you don't know about the story, exposed all of this stuff. And um, I believe the dude. I think he really worked there. I think he really worked on the shit. And I think, I, I believe everything he says. <clears throat> I mean, shit, the dude could could have been making millions of fucking dollars, and he's not, so. That's a good fucking story. I highly suggest that uh, you check it out. This shit here, uh, I'm gonna leave it right in the description. And highly suggest that you watch it. Of course. That's why, because I don't want to fuck up my video or something by uploading that on it. So I'm just going to leave it in the description. Because I can't tell you how many videos I uploaded. Come to find out, uh, I did all that work for nothing because of a two second thing that's in there. So I'm trying to be extra careful. 
martial law mentality has become the new norm in the U.S. And that's exactly what the government wants. Winter storms, leaving people stranded. Folks, they can make it snow, rain, they can make it do anything, anywhere. Okay? Anything, anywhere. If they want a fucking drought, they can cause a drought. It's like they're doing out here. They can make it rain. They've had patents on it since the late 1800s, folks. I've shown you the patents before. I mean, it says right in the Geneva Convention you cannot use weather as a weapon. Now, why would it say that? It, it says against another country. It's okay to use at home for experimental use and stuff. But they're not using it. Yeah, they're using it for experimental use on us. We're breathing in all this fucking bullshit. Um, Hurricane Sandy. They had, I think it was with the election. Last election, I think. I don't know. But when Hurricane Sandy hit, that was a weather weapon. They created that fucking storm. And they steered that hurricane right for New York City. Folks, they could take a hurricane and just end it. Boom. They could stop a hurricane. So why don't they stop a hurricane? I think you fucking know damn well why they won't stop these weather events from happening. They can pinpoint earthquakes. The one in Haiti, that was done by HARP. Um, the one in, I want to say Tunisia or Tanzania, one of those killed fucking tens of thousands of people. That was done by heart. And who the fuck knows how many more. China prepares nuclear strike against U.S. as America rides down the road to hell. Targets could include biggest cities on east and west coast and blast waves that could vaporize Manhattan and well beyond. And I keep telling people about the fucking nuclear threat. I think it's the most major threat. That and a fucking EMP. They're going to lock us in this fucking country. They're going to make the entire country right around the fucking border. The whole thing is going to be one big FEMA camp. We're not leaving the country. Um, they're already starting to do it. People want like uh, non-citizenship or whatever. They're not. They're making them pay like $2,800 now. And it used to cost zero. These people are off our coast. They've been off of our coast doing war games for years. They're testing the public. This is a fallout from an attack on 20 U.S. cities with four mount ground burst warheads. So that's the only, that's like, this like nothing uh, for, can I look at the picture or what? Yeah, this is, this is nothing, I can't see the map. Though. Yeah, well, all I can say is, uh, if you live near a mountain range, get on the east side of it. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. Folks want to check this site out. We occupy earth dot wordpress dot com. And you get links to all sorts of different I mean you name it. It's there. Alright. I'm looking into a little, some more of the, uh, this human clone shit. I'm, I really can't, there's not much to find on it, though. You know, so, I don't know. Um, I'm definitely going to be looking more into this, um, ancient stuff. These hidden artifacts and giants that they're hiding, supposedly, that are living right now. And I know they are, because... 
I've seen video of had to be 12 foot tall people, civilization of them, in the Solomon Islands, fucking walking around. At least 12 feet tall, all of them. So, stay tuned, Permanent Patriot on YouTube, and Fighters That Are Founders on YouTube, and, uh, stay for now, God bless and carry on.